Hello, hello. How are you today? Good evening. Hey, long time to see you, Alejandro. Hey, it was a long time to see you. <laughs> You're back. <laughs> All right. Okay, good. Uh, welcome, Carlos Jose. Um, welcome, uh, Marta Menjivar. Welcome, Osmel Antonio. So, how are you today? Oh, I'm welcome. Fine, thank you. Uh, okay. Welcome, Marta. Welcome, Stephanie. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome, Carla Jovel. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Okay. It's good to see you all today. So tell me, how was your weekend? Tell me. Tell me something good that happened during your weekend to you. Tell me. What do you do? Where do you go? Mm -hmm. Welcome, um, Walter. Hi, teacher. Good welcome. Evening. Good evening. Welcome. Welcome. Okay. okay. So um, tell me something good that happened to you during the weekend. I want to hear, I want to hear those good vibes. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, yeah, what, something good that happened to you during the weekend. Mm -hmm. Oh, no les pasó nada bueno eh, during the fin de semana. A nadie. I don't believe it. No les creo. <laughs> uh <-huh>. Algo bueno <laughs> que les haya pasado during the fin de semana. No, um. teacher, was a bad. Oh, weekend. was okay. Because welcome. My dog, get, my dog got sick. Oh yes, teacher. Uh, you, I you had dog what? So mm -hmm. you, amazing. You dog what? Mm -hmm. Carla, Joel, you dog what? Got sick. Oh, okay. Do you take him to the Chivo Pet Hospital? Mm -hmm. Is it Chivo Pet? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, the really the, the last week, but uh, I think that in that place uh, he got sick because okay. it's a virus and he was good. So, oh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm sorry about your dog. Welcome, Luis Melgar. Welcome. Mm -hmm. So, you were saying, mm -hmm. you were saying, Walter Ramos, what, what were you telling us about your week? Yes, teacher. Uh, I was a uh... I was amazing. I, I, I earning. I was earning twenty five percent over my invest on crypto. Yeah. Wow, that's uh, good. That's a that's good great. news. That's great. Yeah, 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 yeah. Twenty five percent. Wow. Yeah. So that means that if you have yeah. one hundred dollars, you earn twenty five dollar per 25. each one hundred. Yeah. Man, that's amazing. Yeah. Congrats. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we can yeah. talk and then sure. you can tell me how to use yeah, 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 yeah. and cryptos. Uh -huh. yeah. I mean cryptos, yeah. Yeah, but yeah. It's, but it's not Bitcoin, right? No, it's Bitcoin. It's another yeah. coin. No, it's another coin. Yeah. Oh, nice. Another crypto. Yeah. Nice, nice. Okay. Welcome, yeah. Claudia. Uh, welcome, Eneida. Welcome, Stephanie. Welcome, everyone. Okay. Okay, we're talking about how your weekend was. ¿Quién quiere compartirme acerca de your weekend? Hmm? Anyone can help me or anyone can share? Hmm? Eneida, how are you, Eneida? Or Luis Melgar? Mm -hmm. Fine, teacher. Good afternoon. Hi, teacher. Hi. Well, I thought Luis Melgar, you were in to say something. I, thought, <laughs> I was like, okay, okay I'm just waiting. Well, well, like, my weekend, other people. <laughs> my weekend uh, was uh, a little bored, but um, uh, the Sunday I take uh, my dog to the Ciclovia in the morning, mm -hmm. and I uh, Sunday to. Um, I wash my clothes uh, for the weekend, for the week, mm -hmm. uh, for my work, and mm -hmm. that's it. And at the night, um, I eat pupusas. I ate pupusas. And how many? That's how it. many? How many pupusas? Three. <laughs> <laughs> Three. Two, oh, like, two, two well, revueltas. Like, two revueltas. Three. And one. Huh? One of the cheese. 
You know, I have choice. had bad memories. I have had bad memories about, uh, well, I haven't been lucky eating pupusas. I had got um, sick twice after eating pupusas. My and Melinda, God. They, I mean, <laughs> once I, I was, I had to go to the hospital. I remember a year ago, I remember that was the Labor Day in El Salvador. I remember that day, the Labor Day in El Salvador. I got very, very sick after eating pupusa and I had to go to the hospital. And then when I got to the hospital, they told me, you know, you got some food poisoning. You know, when 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 you got a virus while you have um, how many? Yeah, how many do you do you I eat? usually I usually eat two pupusas. I usually eat two pupusas. Okay, your question okay. could be how many pupusas do you eat? How many pupusas yeah. do you ah, eat? Okay, okay. How many uh -huh. pupusas do you eat? Uh -huh. Disposable I, 10 pupusas, teacher. Mm, well, no, I oh, love oh, pupusas, oh. especially pupusas con mayonesa. The best ever. Yeah. The best ever. Yeah, that is a problem. With <laughs> no, 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 no. That's not a problem. That is a problem. That's not yes. a problem. <laughs> yes, I feel you. very proud to eat pupusas with mayonnaise. And you need to eat mayonnaise pupusas. I don't know. Uh, okay. I don't you know what? Your I'm going to invite you all to San Miguel or to Morazan. Only you for, go, only you for mentioning, I felt sick. You will go back to San Salvador. And you will be like, yeah, Mr. Pedro was right. These are the best pupusa ever, pupusa with mayonnaise. Right. <laughs> I feel so disappointed. I know what you were kind of my opinion. Now you are like, no, no, your pupusa opinion. con mayonnaise. Yeah. No. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But believe me, they are It's very, very the classic, only garbage and sauce. No, no. I mean, yeah, it's okay. yeah. it's pupusas good. with cabbage is okay. Uh, they are okay. But with mayonnaise, they are much better. No, no. <laughs> Sounds weird for me, yeah. Okay. Uh, to the point is this one. So uh, sometimes you got to be very careful if you eat pupusas, especially with that kind of cabbage, ese repollo that you eat. Be careful because it, yeah. you can get uh, food poisoned because of that. <laughs> so I haven't yeah. had good memories. I mean, the last times, of, of course, right? Like the... The same veces que he comido pupusas, probably I had got two, two times sick. So it's like, it's nothing, right? Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so welcome, welcome everyone. I can see that I have Maria Correa, that I have Ricardo Mancilla, that I have Claudia Linares, uh, I have Alejandro Ernesto, well, Alejandro Ernesto, I have it already. Uh, I have Lorena Janet Peña, I have Carla Enriquez, and welcome, welcome everyone, okay? By the way, we were not talking about, about pupusas. That was not the topic. Luis Milgar was saying that <laughs> pupusas with cabbage uh, are the best, which I said I said no. So that's why we were talking about pupusas, okay? Anyway, so welcome everyone. It's good to see you one more time. So I hope you are ready to start the classes today. And today we are going to um, start a new topic. Oh, welcome, Joanna Salina, welcome. Welcome, it's good to have you today in our class. All right, vamos al tema right now. Okay, I'm going to, okay. Eh, ¿Cómo van con la plataforma? Cuéntame, ¿todo bien con la plataforma? Yes, ¿algún problema con la plataforma? Carlos José, no estaba peleando con la plataforma. <ríe> uh -huh. Okay, al parecer todo bien. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, remember, next Tuesday, next Tuesday, we are going to conclude this course. Next Tuesday. Tuesday, the 22nd. El 22 se termina el curso. Do you know that, right? ¿Saben eso, verdad? Yes or no? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Yes, teacher. So, okay. So, do not forget to complete your platform. Okay. Do not forget to complete your platform so that you can earn the 80% of the class attendance, okay? Don't forget that. All right, so today we are going to talk about time contrast. In other words, we're gonna be talking about, I'm sorry, excuse me, um, about the past, the present, and the future, all right? So we're gonna be talking about that, um, uh, in today's classes. 
All right. Uh, what is the objective for today? The objective for today is at the end of this class, you will be able to describe um, events using time contrasts between the past, the present, and the future. That means, for example, that if you talk about the past, we are going to be using simple past, simple present, and simple future. For example, I went to the church yesterday, that's simple past. Uh, I go to the church every Sunday, that's simple present. And I will go to the church next, next Sunday, that is future simple or simple future. Okay, good. All right, so let me ask you this general question. What do you remember from the previous week? Buy an al chat and tell me what you remember from last week. Podri puede ser vocabulario, puede ser oraciones, puede ser cualquier punto gramatical, anything that you remember from last week. <laughs> type it. Uh, type it, please, in the chat. Okay. Okay, uh, let me see. Let me go to the chat. Veamos. Holidays. Okay, Walter Ramos says holidays. Okay, good. Okay, Luis Melgar about our favorite holidays. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Joanna Selina says holidays and vocabulary. Oh, Lorena, suggestions. Mm -hmm. Suggestions. Okay. Uh, Ricardo says gerunds. Uh huh. Gerund. What else? Ropa, Raquel. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Easter <laughs> week. <laughs> okay. Osmel Antonio says, what do you do in this holiday? Yes, yes. Holiday, gerund, infinity, suggestions, adverbial clauses of time. Uh-huh. For example, Mother Day is a day when. Mm -hmm. And Ada conjunctions, subordinating conjunctions after, before, etc. Good. Okay. Good. Thank you so much. Okay. Maybe I'm going to give you a piece of advice. Remember that every time en español nosotros decimos, en español decimos el domingo, right? Nosotros decimos en español el lunes, el martes, el miércoles. En inglés nosotros no decimos el lunes, el martes. No decimos, por ejemplo, the Monday. Uh -uh. No decimos the Sunday. Uh -uh. Okay. No decimos así, ¿verdad? ¿Verdad que no se dice así? The Sunday, the Monday. No, 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 no. no. For okay. example, we say on Monday. On, on, on Tuesday. Uh -huh. Okay. En, en, en español nosotros también decimos en la noche, ¿verdad? En la noche. Mm -hmm. yes. Ok. Entonces no decimos uh, at the night. Uh -uh. Mm -mm. No, at night. no decimos at, at the night. night. Decimos at night. Only night. at night. At night. Ok. Just, just be careful with that one. Okay? Do not forget that. Every time you want to say something about when, to, when you do something, no van a decir the Monday or the Tuesday. Or you say, oh, you know what? I go or I went, I went to the school on Tuesday. Okay. All right. Be careful with that one. Okay, please. All right. Good. So let's move on with, uh, with today's uh, activity. All right. So I have a fun activity right now with you. I would like you to, in a piece of paper, listen to me, in a piece of paper or... In, uh, in a notebook or on something else, you are going to do the following. ¿Qué es lo que van a hacer? You are going to write how many words? Three. One, two, three. In each category. For example, we have type of transportation, 
where the finish with letter S, etc. Ok? Así que ahorita vamos a completar hacer eso ahorita rápido. Ok? And let me know when you finish. No tenemos tiempo, but I want you to do it as soon as possible, as fast as you can. Ok? Teacher. Yes. Teacher, uh, repeat, please. Se cortó un poco la. Oh, vamos a. Uh, give me a second. Ok. Vamos a escribir three words per each category. For example, number one, types of transportation. Number two, words that finish with letter S and so on. Okay, that's what we're going to do. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay, good. Start. In a piece of paper or in your notebook, pero no lo vayan a escribir en el chat, please. Okay. Let me know when you finished. Hurry up, hurry up. When you finish, let me know. Okay, number one, let me know. Mm -hmm. Teacher, things yes. in the water, not, not is on the water. It Different. doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Ino, un, uh, but it's uh, or on. Uh -huh, yeah. I would say in, in, in the water, in the water. Mm -hmm. Ah, ah not okay. on the water. Uh -uh. Okay. That would be in the water. Okay, okay, okay. Mm, good observation. Let me know when you finish, please. Did you finish? Yeah. Yeah. Finish. Okay, good, good. Okay, what we're gonna do right now, it's uh, since uh, I have already, I mean, there is one who has already finished. Um. I'm going to send you to a small breakout rooms. Y ustedes van yeah. a compartir sus uh, examples, what you have. Okay? Okay. Maybe you might have the same vocabulary words, or maybe you can have different. All right. Let me set up the breakout rooms. Okay. Here we go. You're going to share. Share your words.
on this time, motorcycle, bus. They yeah. say bus or bus? Bus. 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 Uh -huh. bus. Okay. Okay. Car. Uh, what that uh, finish, finish what is? Yeah. A carrot, a studies, yeah. cookies. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, cooks. Okay. Uh, country that bay in that speed. Portugal, yeah. Panama, Paraguay. Excellent. The next word that is T. Time, Excellent. The fine is a. I want to show you some. I'm with your your words. Okay. Uh the first is type of interpretation is bus problem. Okay. Thank you for the information. Okay. Well, Number two. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Word that finish with S. Okay, I I put takes, wakes, and that's it. I have a sports, response, and only that. <laughs> okay, and countries with B, I write Peru, I write Panama, and Puerto Rico. Good, I only Peru. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, and the fourth? Begin with T. Begin is... A... Um, play with people, Michael Jackson, Papa, uh, Papa Francisco, Bukele, and family members, father, mother, and son. And you, Ricardo? It's your son. Everybody, I'm, I'm still at the work to a toy saying Carlos. Octopus and Guau. Okay. The next the next category. Beyons, Beyons, Leonardo DiCaprio, Rihanna. Mm -hmm. And Carol G, Maluma, Thalia. Hello, Carla Jovel. What are you doing here, Carla? I have a lot of problems with my internet. Oh, that, that's why I... I'm, Hello, I'm, teacher. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. All right. So um give me a second. Give me a second. I'm gonna close the old rooms. Flor Garcia, how are you, Flor Garcia? Flor Garcia. Hola, 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 buenas noches, Flor Garcia. Hi. Oh, Sorry. Is, the, is this Hi. your first time? Can Flor? You hear? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can hear you. No. Mm, quizás por el no. nombre, el nombre eh, casi no I, la reconozco. <laughs> no, I have had some problems when I I try to to connect. So oh. I have tried to connect, but was difficult. Oh, okay, but no, okay, that's okay. Welcome, welcome, Flor. All right. So, uh, how was the activity? How was it? Was it easy? That was easy, right? Especially countries with letter P. That was easy. That's so for fast, it's super mega hyper fast. <laughs> uh -huh. Not too much, but. Colonia and Peru. Oh, Peru and Poland. Okay. Ah, interesting. Yeah. yeah. Poland and Peru. All right. Yeah. So okay. I can see that I, everyone is. I write here. Puerto Rico. Oh, Puerto Rico, Panama. Okay. Okay, so let me share. Vamos a compartir. I'm going to ask you. Okay. Okay. 
Types of transportation. Tell me. Types of transportation. Buses. Buses. Mm -hmm. Plane. Train. Plane. Bicycle. Bicycles. Good. Motorcycle. Motorcycle. Good. Number two. Words Bus. that finish with letter S. Bus. S. Planes. 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 Fence. Boss. Boss. Mm -hmm. Etc. <laughs> you know what? For this one, it can be any word in plural. It can be any yeah. word in plural. <laughs> okay, number three. Countries that begins with P. I call uh, psychology. Mm -hmm. Panama. Country. Countries. Countries. Oh. Countries. Panama. Yeah. Countries. Yeah. Paraguay. Paraguay. Okay. Paraguay. Paraguay. Panama. Paraguay. Rico, Poland. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Etc. Right. Okay. Good. Uh, what about words that begins with T? Transportation. Take. Tomato. 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 Take. Transportation. 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 Good. Very good. Um, veo como que están ahí. Alguien está escribiendo en el chat. ¿Qué pasa? Veo que alguien está escribiendo en el chat de WhatsApp. What's going on? ¿Quiénes son? Do you know? Do you know them? Okay. Uh, number five. I don't know. Okay, things in the water. What about things in the water? Mm -hmm. Fishes. Octopus. Octopus. Fish. Fish. Okay, what else? Land. Plants. Plants. Uh -huh. Crips. Shrimps. Sí. What? What else, man? No, 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 no. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> All right, number six. I, I don't understand the, the question, teacher. I am uh, the clear uh, soda, coffee, lemonade. Oh, no, yeah. no, no, no. Son <laughs> Sorry. Cosas en el agua. Cosas en el agua. It could be yeah. anything yeah. in the water. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> no, teacher, yes. Stone. Uh -huh. It's song. Ah, uh, stones. Okay, no, Joanna, usted tiene... Es que, mira, listen, usted está en todas las respuestas, usted tiene, sus respuestas son correctas. Es como, por ejemplo, un, un maestro le, le dijo a sus alumnos, la vaca da, ¿han escuchado esa historia? La vaca da. Entonces, lo que la maestra quería que la alumna escribiera era leche. La vaca da leche. El niño dijo, bueno, la vaca da huesos. Entonces, la maestra se lo puso malo y le dijo, ¿Y por qué me puso la vaca de huesos? Y le dije, sí, porque me lo como en una sopa. Entonces, ¿quién estaba correcto? <risa> el alumno estaba correcto. Okay. Ah, no, en este da caso... Da patadas digo, ah, también. Dije. Ah, da patadas. Exactly, exactly. <risa> y está en toda la respuesta correcta. Ok. So, in that case... Uh, you no lo que quería algo. escuchar. Uh -huh. ¿Ah? <risa> yes. Probably no lo que that. quería escuchar. Pero... Right, right. Yes, exactly. Okay, so in this case, uh, things in the water, it could be coffee, <laughs> sugar, it could be anything in the water. But what, what I was expecting was like fish, uh, stones, fish. octopus, yeah. all right, plants. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, what about famous people? Famous people. Mm -hmm. Ronaldo. Ron Jennifer Garner. Messi, Messi, Osmer, Messi, <laughs> no Ronaldo, no, no, no. Uh -huh. <laughs> Luca Modric. Uh, Piqué, 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 please, Piqué. Uh -huh. ah, only <laughs> Barça, only Barça, no. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yes, famous people. What about more example? Give me more example of famous people. Richard Kleiderman. Oh. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. well, Wayne, the Roca. Oh, yeah, John Dwayne. Isabel mm -hmm. Queen. The Isabel the Queen, yeah. Me sorprende, by the way, Isabel the Queen. She was sick, but now she's okay. I was like, wow, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. She recovered very quickly. That's very impressive. Okay, how about family members? Mother. 
Mother, brother, 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 son, 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 father, mother, daughter, daughter uh, nephew, nephew, nephew uh -huh. uncle, uncle, uh -huh. uncle, mother in law, mother, mother stepmother, uh -huh. stepfather, brother in law, brother in law. All right. Okay. So thank you so much. I'm going to move on. Ha! Huh, I, I have found out that right now I have one of my students who is Real Madrid fan. Hmm. Okay. Sure. Yes. The last week I I I stayed with a American people. Oh really? Uh -huh. Yeah. And Where they 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 said, for example, grandma. Uh -huh. They say said grandma. Yes. Uh -huh. Grandma. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. a good example. Yeah. When. I don't know if you knew that, but if you didn't know, well, that's a good information that uh, Osmel is sharing with us. Yeah, especially they don't say grandmother because it's too long, okay? It's too long. Yeah. So you can say, my grandma. I went to visit my grandma. Or if you want to say, instead of saying grandfather, you can say grandpa. Grandpa. Mm -hmm. Instead of oh, saying my. grandparents, like means abuelos in general, like Grandma and grandpa, yeah. you can say uh, uh, yeah. grandpas, grandpas, grandpas. Okay, listen, other thing that I'm going to mention today, um, when we are talking about, for example, a question in there, um, what is the plural of fish? Plural fish. Of fish. Uh, it's the same teacher. Exactly, yeah. mm -hmm. exactly. Look, one fish, two fish. <laughs> Yes. Three fish, four fish, and if see them fish, 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 and nothing changes because it's the same. Okay. All right. So thank you, Esmer, for mentioning and sharing that with us. Thank you so much. All right. Okay. Time contrast. Well, remember that when we're talking about time contrast, is because we are contra contrasting the simple past the simple present and the future. For example, right now, in terms of entertainment, in the past, how do people entertain themselves? Mm -hmm. How do people entertain themselves? How? Watching the, um, the TV and listen to the radio. Really? Yeah, listen right. to La Caele, listening to La Caele, yeah. La Monumental. Do you remember that? La Monumental. Yeah. <laughs> Radio Novelas. Radio Novelas. El Roto. What is it? Huh? Chucho El Roto, do you remember? Radio no. Novela. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah For that's... my grand. I remember the Radio Novelas. I used to, I guess it was my grandparents who used yeah. to listen to radio novelas. And I was like, oh my God, what's happening? And believe me, those <laughs> were very captivating. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, good. That was in the past. What about right now? What about right now? Cell phone. Cell phones. <laughs> Computer. Netflix. 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 Smart TV. Uh, smart yes. TV. Seriously. How about in the future? Oh my god. Holograms. Huh? Holograms. Yes, holograms, yes. What? Holograms exactly. to the future. Exactly. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Hologram? To say hologram? Yeah. <laughs> what is hologram? Uh -huh. yeah. It's possible, teacher. Hologram when <laughs> for example, uh, I saw a documentary about the future, like a TV. Mm -hmm. It's a hologram in the future representation. Oh, so you like mean a, like a like a like a like a movie uh, Avengers, like a Iron Man? Yeah, you move like your mm -hmm. hands, the the images. Oh, yeah. you mean like virtual reality? Uh -huh. like, like virtual yeah. reality? Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Uh, well, Example: yeah. uh, the future teacher, uh, nanotechnology. Mm -hmm. nanotechnology. New technology. Yeah. New technology. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I remember. Uh, do you remember when you used to uh, buy CDs and video and yeah. VHS? I guess. Yeah. 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 Do you remember yeah. that? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And, you... and Ren and Blow Bowser. 
I right. can, uh, yeah, yeah. I, uh -huh. I conserve my, 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 my the mind always. Oh, oh, like really? The collection. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember the, the long play for this and that? Yeah. Music? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh -huh. And also, when you were listening to radio, you needed a cassette, and then it was that part A. Yeah. Yes, cassette. Then and the part A and part and B. And last is the rocola. La rocola, yes. And do you remember when when part A was over? Tenía que sacarlo y ponerlo al otro lado, and they went like part B. That was you were set up, change yes. from part A to part B. That's true. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Look, what about transportation? In the past, what happened in the past? How did people carreta. Move? Yeah, how do you say carreta in English? How do you say carreta? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, you say carts. Carts. Cart. Like a... Carretas. Cart shopping. Cart shopping? Mm -hmm. yes. Uh -huh. yes, like cart shopping. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Carts. Okay. Cart. So, and also people used to move from one place to another one through railroads and ocean liners. Mm -hmm. How about now? What about now? Uh, uh, bus, train, April. Okay, hybrid cards, hybrid cards, yeah, yeah. hybrid, hybrid cards. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. See, now uh, we are waiting for the Pacific train, uh -huh, the high speed trains. Right, so <laughs> uh, it's spacecraft. Uh -huh. Yes, okay, that's what's happening right now. What Water about taxi. in the future? What about in the future? In the future, the cars fly, electric the cars car. fly, electric cars, <laughs> self driving cars, especially the Tesla, the Tesla's cars. Los carros Tesla. Mm -hmm. the, the cars uh, like a robot, uh, the cars are uh, moving uh, for, uh, you don't ride, the, the drive is uh, long. A pilot, a pilot uh, a driver. Mm -hmm. Un conductor yes, piloto. Uh, yes. Future. And, yes. And the future like, tele teletransportation. Yeah. Oh, and the future. Yeah. Like, Can you? Video. Can you imagine that? Yeah, Can like you... a CPT, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can yeah. you imagine traveling from here to the United States, like through teletransportation? Well, that would be awesome. I don't think we're going to see that, though. We're going to die before that, to be honest, I guess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How about communication? Yes. How did people communicate in the past? How? Letter. Like Telegram. Okay, Eso, Telegram, letters, de humo. letters. <laughs> there was the smoke signs. Letter fax. Yeah, Mocha. telefax. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you remember Tele. your first cell phone? Do you remember your cell phones? My God. What My brand was it? Like a brick. Like a brick. Like yeah. a brick. It was like a brick. Mm -hmm. It was así de grande. Do you remember when the... With the yeah. Ericsson, do you remember the Ericsson cell phones? Mm -hmm. Ericsson, Sony Ericsson, do you remember? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. When you had a Sony Ericsson. Nokia, Nokia. Nokia, you were like, wow, Nokia. wow, a Sony Ericsson. Yeah. I, I remember. Walkie-talkies. Uh, Walkie-talkies. Mm -hmm. Okay. When so Nokia, tell let me that, ask that you something. Time, you let me ask you this. Okay. How do you communicate with your boyfriend or girlfriend when you were in elementary school? Oh my God. Letters. Uh -huh. How do you communicate? Uh -huh. Public ¿Te telephone? Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Yeah. A little bit piece of shit of paper. Uh, ah, yeah. piece of shit of paper. Uh -huh. uh, yeah. Notes. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Notes, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. What's up? The school. Behind the school. 
the behind the behind the class the classroom right behind the classroom yeah. yeah. okay okay yeah. what about now Ah, ya lo está, ya lo estoy eh, cachando ya todos ustedes. Uh -huh. What about now? What about now? Uh -huh. How do people come? Cell how phone. do people communicate now? Text messaging. Cell phone. Cell phone. Video social phone. media. Social, social media. Social media. Social media. Yeah. Telegram. Telegram, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah. yeah. What about in the future? How how will people communicate in the future? Yes? Metaverse. I don't want to imagine. Ah, huh? through what? Yes, yeah, I suppose in the future, uh, have the cell phone and, or arms. Oh yeah, maybe you can have a microchip, right? Maybe you have a microchip yeah. or something like, yeah. you're gonna do something like this and then everything's gonna yeah. be, uh, I don't know, in your body probably. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Good. Okay. Uh, why? Why was I telling you all of this? It's because the topic that we are going to talk today and tomorrow and the day after tomorrow, it has to be about construct, con, contrasting time between the past, the present, and the future. It is possible to talk about the three tenses at the same time. Yes, especially. If you are talking in a, about one specific object, one specific situation, like the one that I'm gonna show you before. But as you know, look at this one. What can you identify among the one, the words or sentences that are in yellow? What are they? No, I see some palabras. Yes, they are words, but no. what are they? Mm -hmm. What are they doing in there? Mm -hmm. They are what? Uh, they are time a few years what? ago. They are what? Time what? Time uh, past expression. Ah, there yes. you go. Thank you, Smell. As you can see, time expression. Yeah, yeah time expressions, especially uh, because when we want to express anything in at, or using any simple uh, sentence, we need to include time expression. For example. If we want yeah. to talk about the past, we need to use a time expression referring to the past. What about now? Is it simple, present, past, or future? Yeah. Present, future. past, present. or future? Present. Present. Good. present. What about soon? It's future. 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 Good. What about 50 years ago? Past. 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 What about nowadays? It's present. Present, exactly. Yes. So that's what I told you before. Every time we want to express any sentence, we need, or oh, it's important that we mention time expression so that the sentence can be clearer and more understandable. For example, when we talk about a few years ago, ustedes dijeron que estaba en pasado, of course. El verbo va a ir en pasado. Look, a few yeah. years ago, no many people lived. Good. What about this one? Now, miren el verbo presente, right? It is. Okay, yeah. what about soon? You said that soon is a future well, time expression. Look, future. Will. See, will be. You said that 50 years ago, <clears throat> It's referring to the simple past. Vamos a ver. Yes, yeah, see? Walked. Mm -hmm. You mentioned as well that nowadays is a simple present. Vamos a ver si encontramos un verbo en simple present. Yes. Drive. Right. Okay. Let me show you more examples about the few uh, time expressions. Okay. Time expression. Okay, as you can see, these are examples of time expressions. We have time expression to express the simple past, time expression to express the present, and time expression to express the future. All right, 
I would like you to um, I would like you to write at least two sentences, two sentences using the simple past and two sentences with the present and two sentences with the future in the chat. For example, yesterday mm -hmm, I went to the supermarket. All right, simple. What about present? This month I go to the supermarket. What about future? I will go to the supermarket, supermarket next week. See? Simple, right? Okay. Okay. Usted me puede decir, teacher, ¿y será que puedo colocar la time expression al final de la oración? Yes. For example, you can say, I go to the supermarket this week. Or, oh, I went to the park last weekend. See? ¿Sí? Okay, vamos en el chat. I want you to type sentences using time expressions, please. Okay, vamos a ver. Carla Jovel, the last week I play basketball. Good, good, good. Vamos a ver, ¿qué más ejempl otros ejemplos? Hola, yo tengo una pregunta. Ajá, dígame, dígame. Uh -huh. En el caso de, de la expresión del presente, as, uh -huh. we, as we speak, eh, ¿qué significa? Oh, uh, as we speak es como que digamos... Um, Como cuando nosotros estamos hablando, como, ¿cómo sería eso? As we speak. Como que está pasando algo en el momento que usted y yo estamos hablando. Uh -huh. As we speak. For example, for example, okay. As we speak, as we speak, Russia is attacking Ukraine. ¿Sí? Ok. Rusia está atacando a Ucrania. As we speak. Uh -huh. O sea que mientras nosotros estamos hablando ahorita, ¿qué está haciendo Rusia? Russia is invading Ukraine. See, an example. Is that clear, Mancia? Yeah, in this moment. Yeah, as we speak, as we speak, uh, my daughter is sleeping. Mm -hmm. As we speak. Mm -hmm. Okay. Es algo que está pasando al momento, mientras nosotros estamos hablando ahorita. So, está pasando en el presente. Mm -hmm. It could be at this moment or, or puede ser en este periodo de tiempo. Puede ser as we speak, uh, people go to the United States um, on the way. Va para Estados Unidos. Mientras nosotros estamos hablando ahorita, hay muchas personas que están yendo a Estados Unidos. Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher, how question? Yes, yes. It's the same as we use while. While, yes, you can say while we are talking, yes. We can say that the only thing is um, we are using different time. Uh, we are using different uh, time of sentences. For example, we can say while we are speaking, mientras estamos hablando, a lot of people are traveling to the United States. While we are doing something, something else is happening. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. As we speak okay. es mientras hablamos. But you... Mientras hablamos, correcto. Mientras hablamos, as we uh -huh. speak. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes. Okay, okay Cristóbal. Okay, yes, Cristóbal. Uh, did I answer your question, Cristóbal? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. Let me check your sentence. Wow. I can see. Puedo ver muchísimas oraciones. That's good. La voy a leer randomly. Voy a tomarla así al azar cualquiera. Mm -hmm. Yesterday I went to mm, Osmel. Yesterday I went to work. Ok. Hmm. Hmm. ¿Cuál sería el problema ahí? ¿Alguien me puede ayudar, por favor? Yesterday. El verbo en pasado. Oh, solo un verbo, ¿verdad? Only one verb. Mm -hmm. Yesterday I went to work. Work. Ajá, yes. Okay. Vamos a ver a Carla Jovel. This month I play basketball. Mm -hmm. Let me see, Lorena. When I was born, my mother had 32. Mm. Lorena. My mother was, was 32 years old, okay? 
Ok, Lorena. Do you hear me? ¿Me escuchó? Ok, good. Ok, good. Uh, let me see, Rosa. Uh, I ate hamburger, hamburger yesterday. Good. And Aida, the last month I worked a lot. Ok, vamos a ver aquí. Uh, and Aida, last weekend I went to the park. Hmm. Let me see, Walter. This morning I took my wife to the supermarket. Good. Vamos a ver aquí. Ah, vamos a ver. Carlos José. Uh, yesterday I went to El Congo. Again. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let me see, Marta. Last week I did exercise in the park. Good. Let me see, Maria Correa. Last month I removed a tooth. Oh, no. ¿Le duele todavía, María? ¿O todavía no? ¿Ya no le duele, María? ¿O, o es un solo ejemplo? <laughs> Okay. Solo un oh, I was like, even <laughs> you, Kelly, I see, lo siento. Okay. Um, in the near sure. future, yes. After time expression, mm -hmm. it's comma or no? I remember. You can use commas. Yes, you can use commas. Oh, okay. 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 Osmel says, now I'm driving my car. Mm -hmm. Okay. Rosa Lopez, as we speak, many people, Rosa, uh, many people are sleeping. Okay are sleeping remember people it's plural therefore okay i should use are as we speak many people mm -hmm. are sleeping okay i'm sorry joanna uh in an hour i be i i'll be spilling really oh, spilling sorry okay. it's, it's sleeping oh, sleeping <laughs> oh okay i was like spilling okay okay sorry i uh, know that's okay uh, vamos a ver. Next week I went to church yesterday. Good. Next month I'm going to I'm going to the beach. Oh yeah, Liz Melgar. Me too. I think. Mm -hmm. Me too. Vacation, right? Estamos en vacaciones next month. Um, let me see, Janet. This year I have a pet. Tomorrow someone is going to repair my computer. All right. The day after tomorrow I'm going to go to the beach. Okay, that's good. All right. Good. I can see good examples. Okay, tomorrow, since we have a couple of minutes to go, tomorrow we're going to be uh, talking about time contrast. Well, basically, I'm going to start today and I will finish tomorrow. As you can see right here, uh, we can express um, when we are constru uh, constructing um, things, we can construct them then in the simple past, in the simple present, and in the simple future. For example, look. A few years ago, ¿cuál sería la time expressions ahí? ¿Me puede decir alguien? A few years ago. Good. A few years ago. What happened a few years ago? Okay. A few years ago, no many people lived. Mira el verbo. Look. Okay. Lived here. Simple, uh, simple present. These days, the population is growing so fast. What is the time expression in there? What is the time expression? These days. These days. Good. Look at the future. Soon, there will be apartment blocks everywhere. Time expression? Soon. Soon. Okay, good. As you know, there are different ways that we can express the simple past. El primero es con el verbo, ¿verdad? El verbo en pasado. The next one is utilizando used to. ¿Se acuerdan de used to, used to, used to? ¿Se acuerdan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, and also I can use what? Uh, again, uh, walked. Um, the simple past. Okay? Uh, 50 years ago, people walked everywhere. Okay? And people used to rent videotapes. Mm -hmm. But, por cierto... Aquí, ¿cómo traducirían esta palabra? Vamos a ver esta oración. How would you translate it? 50 años atrás. Hace 50 años. O oh, hace 50 años, ya. Yeah. Las personas caminaban por donde quiera. Look, look. Ajá. Hace poco. Caminaba, sí, caminaba. 50 years ago, people walked everywhere okay okay mm -hmm. y como traducirían el primero a few years ago no many people lived mm -hmm. 
¿Cómo lo atravesaría? Hace unos, hace unos años. Hace algunos años. Hace pocos hace algunos años. años, años no muchas personas vivía. vivieron aquí. Vivieron. vivieron o vivían acá. Ok. Ok, good. That's vivían. good that you know. That's good. All right. So look at the next one. People used to rent videotapes. Today, las personas estaban personas solían rentar a rentar o alquilar videotapes. Video la yes. gente solía rentar videotapes. Good. Today, people download uh -huh. movies online. Uh -huh. In Hoy a few years, la... okay. In a few years, movie theaters might not exist. Well, and I guess that's Hola. going to happen. ¿Verdad que eso va a pasar? In the future, nobody yeah. is going to go to the movies. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay, next. 50 years ago, people walked everywhere. Nowadays, comma, people drive their cars instead. People are going to have self-driven cars in the future. In the future. All right? So as you can see... Yes. Preguntas. Mm -hmm. Any question? Any question? Any question? No? No questions? No, hello. teacher. Hello, hello. Okay. Listen, tomorrow we are oh, going yeah. to write sentences. Sentences. Uh, contrasting what? Contrasting the simple past, the simple present, and the future. For example, look at here. In the past, very few people use computers. Today, people use computers all the time. In the future, there will be a computer in every home. Okay? So tomorrow, we're going to be talking about cell phones. We're going to be talking about computers. We are going to be talking about what? About... Um, about what? No um, about wait, 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 wait. about uh, cell phones, tablets, cars, etc. Okay. Mañana vamos a estar utilizando esta expresión. Oh, yeah. Yes. Okay. In the past, in the future, now, and in the future. All right. So uh, we have got to the end of the class. I hope tomorrow we can join. And remember, el martes terminamos. That means que de hoy al miércoles terminamos sección número 4 y comenzamos el día jueves, comenzamos la sección número 5, que es la final antes del examen final, que sería el día martes. Ok, next week. Ok, so do you have any question before we go to sleep? Mm -hmm. <laughs> My cassette teacher. Oh, do you have the bookies o los temerarios? Yeah. Y... Temerario, temerario, temerario. Uh, I, yeah. I, I, guess, I guess Walter has uh, the, the temerarios cassette because every weekend mix. he mix. goes to Ilopango. Oh, he goes to Coatepeque Lakes and he drinks some beers. Yeah. Yeah, he says yes. Drink beer. <laughs> okay. Okay, so it's good to see you, everyone. I hope to see you tomorrow. Have a wonderful night. I'm going to see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone. Okay. Okay. Hey, See you tomorrow. Good night, everybody. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.